Hi everybody, happy Friday. I got into a little chat with Golden Spirit Rising on one of his videos about Lepidolite and I asked him if he'd like to see my collection and so this is what I'm doing right here. Uh, I will put a link to his channel down below. He has some really interesting videos. So uh, let's see. This is the Lepidolite that I have and this over here is my lithium quartz and the reason why I have the lithium quartz out as well as showing the lipidolite is because they both contain lithium and that is what gives them similar qualities so I thought it would be interesting to show both at the same time so let's see so from here over is lipidolite this is the one that I have And if you know anything about lip, uh, lithium, excuse me, it's it's for calming. It's very calming. These are two rough pieces that I have. I'm hoping these are going to show up well on my video. If not, I might have to redo this with different lighting. I generally try not to worry too much about that, but. I would like the colors to show up. These are tumbles that I have. So I'll show you this one separately. So these are some just simple tumbles that I have. And stones that I like to work with, I like to have rough pieces as well as tumbles for different purposes. So you can see this one has more of that purple and white color in it. And this one is more of a mauve pink tone to it. And this one, here's one side of it. And then, let me see. Maybe that'll be better. another side to it. I like this piece a lot. Another thing about Lepidolite is it is often found with tourmaline and I do love tourmaline. And um, let's see, so here's two pieces I pulled out where it's with tourmaline. So here you can see blue tourmaline and then if you flip it over can see this. There's a little light right there. So I like combination pieces like that. And then this one, let's see. You can see it on top of almost like these trunks of tourmaline. You can see the little light on top. And then here you can see it's a, like a purple tourmaline. Hopefully you can see. Probably maybe should have done this with a little bit different lighting. We'll see how this turns out. So I like this piece. And let's see. another one <laughs> and another one you can see all the different layers to it and here's another piece this is more pink the other side of it is it's a little more lilac-y on the bottom, and then kind of more pink on the top. And then this piece is pretty cool. It's 
sort of the same thing where it's some, a little bit of tourmaline and a little bit of lipidolite on the matrix. There, you can see it's on some quartz. So, I like that piece a lot. Okay, and then I'll be right back and I'll show you just a little bit more. Okay, I'm hoping these will show up better against this green than they were against that purple. So, this is the lithium quartz that I have. And um, lithium quartz is like a cousin to lipidolite because they both have lithium in them. And they have similar coloration to them. And um, it's only found in one place in Brazil. All of these pieces I got from people on... Instagram. So this is the biggest piece I have. And you'll see it has similar colors to the lipidolite with the lilacs and the pinks and the purples and a little bit of gray. Here's that piece. And here's this piece. And a lot of times they'll have little phantoms in them, which is cool. So those are those. So that's it. I have the lipidolite is something I started collecting about three years ago, I guess. And the lithium quartz I got in 2015, I believe in the spring, maybe early summer or something like that. Yeah, so that's it. And if anybody doesn't have any and they're just curious about it, I do recommend just starting off with little tumbles because they're perfectly good for working with. And a little will go a long way. You certainly don't need a big piece um, to start working with lithium quartz or um, lipidolite. And beyond the color, it's just so pretty. It really does have a relaxing energy. And so I do recommend it. And this was a nice little topic to cover. A nice little break. And um, let's see, I have a couple more videos I promise to do. I'll try to get those done over the weekend. And I hope everybody is having a great start to the weekend and a great finish to their week. And I wish you many blessings as always. And uh, please check out his channel. I will put the link down below. I'll see you soon. Bye.